There it is. Windy Valley. Well, let's go. Welcome back, everybody. It's the Fat Rogue, Sarah Next, and then we're playing some more Evil Land 2. Uh, where we left off before was not in this building, but I came back in here doing some testing with the uh, recording software, and I remembered we needed a book, so I went over to talk to him, and uh, I remember that one of the professors gave us a book already, so... Uh, so we're good to go on that on that point. So at this point, I think I have OBS. It works different than the other stuff. So I'm having to use OBS Studios, and then I have to extract the commentary, and then I have to add it back in. It's a mess. But we're going to do it this way so that we can finish it and go on through, because it's important that we finish games. It is. Because you're just robbing the game of its value by not finishing. So, that being said, if if you're enjoying this series, you can show your support by booming on that like button. And if this is your first time here, go ahead and click that subscribe button. It won't hurt at all. I promise you it won't. I'm going to move some stuff out of the way here. I know there's no mouse, but for some reason I always want to just sit here and hold the mouse while we play. Alright, so we need to go find the little uh, brats. I mean, uh, youngins. I think we got to go in here. Excuse me. Good grief. And we gotta give them, let's say, their book. Uh, let's see. Bronze, smug, kitty ass, but ah, 50 drinking games. This can't be right. Oh, you brought us a book. Let's see here. 50 drinking games. You'd give this to some innocent girls? Then again, it'll come in handy when we're older. You basically kept your promise. So here, this is for you. What did we get? A star! We gave a bunch of girls a... a bunch of girls a drinking game. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, so now we got that done. So we got our information. Where are we supposed to go from here? Is there a journal? Let's see. I done forgot where we're supposed to go. Any of you guys remember? No? Oh, well. Let's see. I guess we could leave. Can we get in the sewer? Oh, let's go up top and see if we can talk to these guys. But first, we're going to go to the sewer. The sewer. The sewer. Ha ha. You got hit. You got hit in the shoulder and got thrown off your... Your game. Hey, we can get back here. That's odd. That's so odd. I guess you can't get in here. That guy's just gonna stand there and reminisce at that sewer all day long. All right. So what we got in here? I don't remember half this stuff. Could we? Could we get through the door? No. Okay. So we'll just move on. And what about, ooh, he came out of there running, didn't he? Good grief. What about in here? Huh. He don't look happy, does he? I'd rather eat here than in a tavern. This way I save up money to buy myself a meal at McDonald's every once in a while. Makes me drool just thinking about it. At McDonald's must be expensive. If the prophet has his rules, so does the militia. First rule of the militia is you do not talk about the militia. Second rule of the militia is you do not talk about the militia. And don't even ask about rule 34. I think it's supposed to be 3 and 4, but we'll see how that goes. Are you asleep, dude? No, don't take. In the bureau. Oh, 50 gold. Nice. We took it though. He told us not to. Is that okay? Huh. After a long day, members of the militia come and rest here in the old Imperial Guard Room. It's funny to think that a hundred years ago during the war, soldiers actually lived here. They must have had very skilled lieutenants to have won the war. Yeah, let me in here. Alright, so I can't go in there. So 
we'll go on to the next section. Meow. Meow. I hope you guys are having a really great day. I really do. Can't get in there. We've talked to both of them. Can we sneak in from back here? No. Alright, so I guess we leave town. At this point. Go see what this prophet's doing over here with this gym. Oh, no, no, we got a letter, didn't we? Yeah, we can, we can take a boat to the pirate island now. Who are you? You just got to Genoa, right? It's obvious from your tank. Oh, yeah. Hard enough from you already. All right, so now we got to run over here to the, to the harbor so that we can go to the ghost island. I'm not sure we want to, though. I mean, can we do anything at the other place? Let's go see if we can do anything at the other place before we go that way. I'm worried we're going to leave parts of the story behind, and I need to figure out how to get those treasures out of that temple. There's a few treasures in there I'm missing. A few of them. Look, it's raining. It's always raining over here. Look, there's a big cat. Don't even try to scale the pyramid. It's so slippery, even the famed ninja squirrels never made it to the top. To get inside, you need to reach it by air, but without wings, it cannot be done. When humans fly, as they say, that rain is really loud. I'm going to turn it down a little bit for me. I hope that's enough for you guys. What else we got over here? Oh, we can go down right here. What are you doing? came here to become a disciple, but novice training is really difficult. You have to master quite a few skills. I'm not sure I'll make it. Well, what about you? The number five has always intrigued me. I mean, really, it's a special number, don't you think? It pops up everywhere. The story of the five little pigs, the tale of the five musketeers, and of course the five keys to be collected by the great destroyer before annihilating the world. As strange as Strange can be. Why five? Five little pigs, huh? What's down there? What's over here? Hello? What are you doing? I've always dreamed of touching the stone of time, but only the prophet has this honor. Our greatest treasure kept safely atop the pyramid. Do you think that by touching one can communicate with the great destroyer. Well, I don't know. Oh, 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 we can. We can bust pots. Yeah, that's uh, we'll to bust all the pots on the way out. What y'all done? Do you want to take the novice test? Why not? Listen carefully to my question and choose the correct answer. The great disaster was the first omen of the world's annihilation. What would the second be? Blood. Yes, exactly. That's why we built the pyramid. That way we can. That way we'll all be able to survive when the water covers the world. Your novice training isn't over yet. Speak to the other professors to continue the test. Do you want to take the novice test? Fine. Listen carefully to my question and choose the correct answer. Before destroying the world, the great destroyer must first do something. What is it? Trying to 70, reach a power level, not that and collect five keys. Yes, that's it. There's surely a hidden meaning to the keys, but the prophet is unequivocal when it comes to the number five. The novice trading isn't over yet. Speak to the other professor. Continue. Do you want to take the novice test? Yes. Fine. Listen carefully to my question and choose the correct answer. The great eye symbolizes the great destroyer. It is etched into our most precious treasure. What is this treasure? The Stone of Time. Well done. Indeed, the Stone of Time is kept at the very top of the pyramid. The prophet discovered it near the smug shortly after the great disaster. Congratulations, you passed the novice test. But that's only the first step. To become a disciple, you need to go to Windy Valley and then climb Mount Alpha. 
top Mount Alpha, you'll have to spend an entire day meditating before I assemble the great eye. Only then will you be ready to become a disciple. Well, you get all that. Gotta climb some mountain, I reckon. I don't see any more pots. Apparently, those were the only pots we could break. Yeah, I thought maybe you'd tell him, hey, it's not so bad. But, you know, whatever. Does that work on the work? Back pots. Take them pots. That beautiful camera and we're the ones who built it. It required lots of hard work, but when the water covers everything, we'll be able to take shelter in there. Still, a slight detail has been niggling me. Do you think it'll float? No. Entrance to the Great Pyramid is restricted. Only the Prophet and the other disciples can go in, and there's no point searching for the key in the door. Only Just the other day, the prophet was locked out because of a sudden drive. It took a while. It took a whole week to force the door open, and then it had to be replaced. The prophet proclaimed drafts to be a sign of the world's annihilation. That's funny. The door's closed. Alright, the Windy Valley, huh? Where's that supposed to be at? Huh. Is there a map? No. Well. How do we get to Windy Valley? Is that down there? It's probably something we do later. I'm guessing that little thing that uh, lowered us down in there. Alright, so now we'll run over here. Maybe not. Maybe we can go down here. Is there anything down here we can do? No? There it is. Windy Valley. Well, let's go. What's this? Aw, somebody's tombstone. He who sought to fly like the wind, unknown inventor. Oh, can we hit it? What are you doing, old man? I know you, long time no see. What are you doing here then? We call this place Windy Valley, but the wind guardian hasn't been seen here in ages. One guy actually tried to get the wind going again, but he died in the attempt. Anyway, as you know, none of that really matters. Well, that's no way to be. None of that really matters kind of stuff. That's, that's, that's a sad way to look at life. Well, there ain't nothing else here we can hit, so we gotta go up here and talk to these fine gentlemen standing in front of this door. Ooh, that was a chest. Did you see it? I saw it. Did you see it? Top Mount Athens, you'll find an old temple dedicated to the Great Destroyer. There's also an old rusted out doohickey in the corner. It looks like some winged machine. Weird, huh? I wonder what it's meant to do. Access to the top of Mount is restricted to those apprentices who have passed the novice training in order to become disciples of the Prophet. If you have not passed, you shall not pass. Oh, you're that new novice. I was told you'd be coming to finish your training. That's right, get out of the way. Watch yourself, climbing Mount Alpha is most perilous. After all, we've had a little use for weak disciples. Only the best among us will earn their place in the world post-annihilation. Watch there be an elevator or something in here, that'd be too funny. Let's see. Do, 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 do. Boom. How do you like that? Oh wow, we got some height. Looks like we're going forward. Boom, 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 boom. This is cool looking, man. I like this. Look at that, that dinosaur down there. I'm guessing we bounce. Any 
Anything we do in here? This where we need, uh, oh, uh, main house. How about it, main house? Will you bust this rock for me? Oh, yeah. Not real sure where to go here. Let's see. Boom. That didn't work. Hmm. How about it, Manos? You think you can knock this guy on his, on his, on his loop? Oh, apparently spikes hurt. Spikes hurt. I repeat, spikes hurt. something down? No, I don't think so. Hmm. Well. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on back here, Krabby. I see that chest. How we get in there? Right here. Oh, yeah. Da -da -da -da. I like me some green goop now. Alright, can we get up there from here? Ah! Ah! Take that! Oh, yeah. Oh! Oh! Oh yeah. Oh yeah, you can't be scared. You can't be scared. Look, we went all the way to the end. <laughs> There's spikes up there and everything. Die spiders. Oh no, this is gonna be ugly. Mushroom in the background, just weaving in the wind. Boom! Here comes my nose. Y'all ready? Oh yeah, we got more than one with that one. Boom! We are pooning this cape. Oh, oh, that didn't work. 
cat somewhere. to use two fingers, I think. Ah, uh, we just go back up there and get it. Come on, spider. Well, what's down here? A level up. That's what we got. Nothing like a nice hard turdy. Woohoo! Hey, look at all them. Let's do, let's do a little save here. Looks like we'll be doing some jumping. Oh yeah. Most definitely doing some jumping. It's like insta death to fall on their spikes. It's terrible. It's terrible. Yeah, you can forget that one. Quite the impressive little puzzle here. Ah! <laughs> Got greedy. That's what happens when you get greedy. That's what happens. <laughs> All right, guys, we're gonna call it right there. This has been the Fat Rogue Saturn X, and you've been watching Evil Land Two. Show your support by booming on that like button. If this is your first time here. Hit the subscribe button. I want you to enjoy your day, enjoy your life. Keep on gaming, y'all. May God bless you. Over now.